My name is Will Humphrey. Uh, I studied English Literature at Exeter from 2002 to 2005 and my current position is Planner at Anomaly London. There's a very nuts and bolts answer to how my degree helped me which is you know, the ability to be able to write cogently and I think still, even though it's a bit old-fashioned to say it, written communication when applying for jobs, particularly in advertising or any communications related discipline like PR or, or marketing, is the most important thing. When I graduated in 2005, I applied widely, got roundly rejected in truth. I honestly thought that my uh, degree would get me in. I thought that that one, my you know, knowledge, of, a bit of a knowledge of advertising would get me in. And that really wasn't the case. I was a bit blasé about it, truth known. I didn't really think enough about how I was perceived, what it was I had to say, the right way I had to hold myself, how the, all these things were. All the things that you come as second nature once you're in a job, but you look on the outside looking and you don't really think about. So I worked at home uh, in various jobs to come to London to do work experience at a few agencies um, and I managed to get those positions by basically harassing HR and uh, sort of trying to find out when they were opening any work experience. Normally it would be great if they were paid and they were sort of paid but not a lot so I basically couldn't afford to survive in London on, on my salary. The one I got into the business with was an agency called Saatchi & Saatchi. I started there as a uh, graduate account assistant in July 2006. Did various bits of freelance work through my contacts, people I met, and started an agency called Low London as a planner in October 2007. Uh, worked there for two and a half years as a planner on various car brands, so uh, Saab, Chevrolet, Vauxhall cars and Vauxhall vans and uh, also on MTV, also on various bits of new business, just as, uh, in some cases, as the lead planner, in other cases, as the junior planner, doing sort of slightly straight research. More recently, um, from sort of uh, October onwards, I've been working uh, at an agency called Anomaly. Uh, and Anomaly are an advertising marketing agency uh, that essentially, they produce ads, but they also produce more than that, so they will do press public relations, they will uh, come up with new products. I mean one of the things we've done is help launch the New York Cosmos uh, in New York, the football team, and we've taken a stake in them, so our business success is linked to that. And that's fascinating, and for me that's sort of the future of where advertising and marketing is heading. When I applied for Saatchi and Saatchi, there were 1,500 students for six to eight places. So really you have to stand out in some way, whether that's being, whether that's having a broader presence, either social media or uh, some method of pointing to how you think, particularly in planning, because planning is all about being able to showcase your opinions in an interesting and engaging way. So whether that's, I don't know, having a Twitter profile, using some, something like SlideShare to showcase presenta strategic presentations or just something which gives me, an it gives me a sense of who you are before I've ever met you. The best advice I could give for interviews is pause occasionally. So there's no, nothing to stop you from just stopping and starting again. That makes people think that you're thinking about what to say next, but doesn't make people think you're stalling or not sure what to say. And it also it helps you pace yourself out, helps you think about what you're saying next, helps you structure an argument much in the same way you do in writing.